Guys, I wanted to show you this. Uh, it locks up your steering wheel. I'm not going to use this all the time, but a lot of times when I go on vacation or I'm parking my Honda Pilot in a real bad area, I want this. It's small. Look at the thickness of the steel. The steel is all covered with a very, very thick PVC. On top of that, it has this nice sheath. Uh, it covers it very, very well. But here's how you work it. You go ahead and put it through here, just through the steering wheel, and then you put this through here, like that, okay? Then you come over here, can you see? Come over here, and it just plugs in. Now, let's go ahead and start the car. Now, there's nothing you're gonna do if someone steals uh, your key code, and they can do that very easily. If this is in your house, they have mechanisms now, and what they can do is they can stand outside your house and they can copy. This is always putting out a signal unless you're putting this in a Faraday bag, okay? So this is putting out a signal. And so they can actually very easily nowadays with all the latest, greatest technology, copy the signal from your remote inside your house, come inside and start your car. But what they can't do now with this, okay, is they can't drive it, okay? See, I can't drive it. I can't I can't steer it. I mean, I may be able to do it a little bit, but not enough to get it out of the driveway, and I can actually tighten this up if I want. Instead of it putting it here, okay, I can put it over here. So there is no way you're going to drive the car. Yes, they can start it if they get that signal from your key fob, but they cannot drive it. And so I absolutely love this. I mean, I just think it's awesome. Let me show you how to uh, unlock the mechanism. You. Here's the key. You get two of these keys, and they're actually pretty decent. Um, your would-be stupid thief is not going to take the time if they see this device. Look at this. This is intimidating. If they see this hooked on, they're going to go to the next car, to the next neighborhood, to the next house. OK, they're not going to fool with it. OK, it's the path of least resistance to people who steal cars with the key. I'm putting it in and I'm just pushing and turning. OK, I push and turn and then it comes off and then I easily undo it. That's it. I mean, I really, really like this thing. Let me show you what I was talking about over here. I put it over here and I think, yep, it will just barely fit. And there is no room. Look at this. Look at this. Let me start the car. Look at this. You can go right or you can go left, but you cannot go right at all. Okay. And so that's just not going to work. Okay. I mean, yeah, I can go left and go around the block in circles. Okay. But I can't even get out of my driveway. I have to be able to turn right. And so this is genius. I really like this. I like this more than the club because the, the would-be thieves have figured ways around the club, how to get through those clubs, but they have not figured out how to do this. And so um, I like it. I really do. Remember, I push down. And as I'm pushing down, I pull that off. comes right off. Um, I give this five stars out of five stars. It's priced where I would think it would be priced. You're getting an awful lot. It's not cheap. It's very well made. Uh, this is ballistic polymer here. This is a nylon sheath, which I, I feel I've seen some of these where you can't even cut through these. Uh, it's difficult. And then look at the steel here. It's very, very thick steel. And so uh, you're getting something that's very, very decent and it's going to save you. And again, am I going to use this all the time? I'm not. But there are times when I'm not parking it in the garage, when I'm on vacation, when I'm in a bad neighborhood that I'm going to put this on. It is worth it, especially because of what they can do to get the signal out of your key fob. Thanks for watching, guys.